Hello everybody, and today I'm just going to be doing some face brushing. And I'll just be brushing myself a little bit. Sorry about that. It's my phone. I just buried under the sheets. <laughs> Oh, and you can see here my little stick and poke tattoo. I am not yet finished with it yet. I have to go over it at least two more times. Maybe even once if I do it well. I've actually got quite a few done. Um, I did this one, and then there's an X right here. It's really hard to see, though. Um, and then I also did one on my ankle and on my other ankle. It took me quite a while to do all of them. I guess I'll just do a little bit of rambling in this video. It's going to be silent, but I guess I'm in the mood to talk. Yeah, so I did that, me and my best friend, um, Damon B. Did that together that was really cool um, and it turned out really really good like they're not infected we took really good care of them made sure we used the right utensils right ink I mean I wouldn't recommend it to everyone or anyone actually because it's something that you really have to consider and think about because it is permanent and it does have a higher risk of infection than a normal tattoo would have but if you have the resources and if you know you're fairly healthy it's kind of fun but yeah that's really all that's happened this week okay i'm lying um <laughs> Um, as some of you know, I was in a partial treatment center, um, just kind of working on myself, and I did discharge today, so that's really cool, um, and I'm really excited to not have to wake up at 8 o'clock every morning now, 
Um, I also, they also sent me home some articles, and I know some people really enjoyed the other article I read about, um, uh, what was it again, dopamine. So if you would like me to read the other articles, they're not about dopamine or anything like that, but they're centered around mental health, I can definitely do that for you. I might just do it anyway. <laughs> Gonna try to knock out a whole bunch of videos in a row tonight or tomorrow night because I am getting lazy and that's not good. But other than that, nothing's really been happening. That's okay though, sometimes we just need a breather. My camera is not... Oh, there it goes. <laughs> it's been doing really weird things with focusing lately. Sorry about my really gross nails. Um, I had to cut them down to the nub. <laughs> Basically, well, maybe not the nub, but I had to cut them down a lot shorter than I'm used to because I got ink underneath my fingernails and it was not coming out so I had to cut them it made me very sad <laughs> and hopefully they'll grow out again fast because I can't really tap very well with these stubs but that's okay I actually kind of enjoy um, the sound that people make you know when they don't have really long nails um, they more use like the pads of their fingers and it's still a really nice sound especially for me it's soothing one of my um, favorite ASMR artists um, Vintage Tingles Lucy um, she taps like that and I really really like it sometimes you don't have to have like stiletto nails <laughs> okay. I don't know if stiletto is the right word, but you know those ridiculously long nails. Maybe not ridiculous. Some people like them like that. Just not really um, my uh, favorite type of nail. <laughs> Sorry if you can hear my bed squeak. It is really, really noisy. Um, and I mean like ridiculously noisy. I can't roll over without it creaking like crazy. It's kind of sad. <laughs> but it's really comfy then. If you guys would like me to do more videos like this, you can just let me know down below. Or if you have any suggestions, I'm always open to them. Um, sometimes it takes me a little while depending on what it is. Um, role plays take me a little bit longer to organize. Especially, um, you know, if they're like a little bit like, um, I guess challenging or something like that. You know what I mean? Take a little bit more effort. <laughs> I do requests and um, make videos on my own and all that stuff. I actually really enjoy rambles. I really don't do them that often. I think this is my first ramble video. I just always feel so awkward talking about myself <laughs> or other things for too long. But I guess other people like rambles, so 
And I'm always open about talking about myself. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll be seeing you later.